The Lord knows you. Jeremiah chapter 12 and verse 3. But as for me, Lord, you know my heart. You see me and test my thoughts. Drag these people of you like sheep to be butchered. Set them aside to be slaughtered. What an affirmative text to encourage our famished heart and mind. No one knows us better than God who created us and is caring for us. When we know this truth, it truly excites us. Our parents do not know much about us, our spouses do not, our children, our siblings, our friends, our colleagues, our neighbors, nor anyone. Only God knows who we are and what are our choices and weaknesses are. If we are connected with Christ, our life finds meaning. A sustained relationship with Him fulfills all our heart's desire. I can vouch for that since I have enjoyed how God can bless and be joyful when we cherish what He has blessed us with. For the glory of God, I'm sharing this. He knows us like none would ever know. I was enjoying the ministry at the jail in India when my friend Sudan David invited and introduced me to it. I was consistent for almost a year before COVID brought everything to a standstill. With that at hand, and we moved to the US and was so desperate about the ministry that I missed much. God knew it and he connected me to a chaplain here and I got back again into the jail ministry. This time I was ministering to the adult prisoners with freedom openly talking about Jesus setting them free. What amazed me was this. The chaplain Dave has been praying for more than two years for someone to help him in this ministry passionately, though he did have two of him helping him. He told me that I was in answer to his prayer. It just amazed me since God knew me better than anyone. So it is our heartfelt duty to be connected with him throughout our lifetime. The Lord knows you. Amen.